Okay, if you're playing 7 co-op, S-V-E-N co-op with a buddy, and you're playing co-op multiplayer, and you die, you want to be able to respawn. So, I'm going to show you how to do that real quick, and it's going to be really fast because it took me about 30 minutes to try to figure it out and uh, make it easy for you. So, um, I got on the screen what you need to type in and the steps that you need to take, but I'm going to go through it real fast. So, let's get in the game. Alright, so you got the game up. Okay. What you want to do first is um, you want to open up your server.config file, um, which you can find in your program directory. So, for me, it's under File Explorer, and then under uh, G for me. And then you want to go to um, your installation directory, which I think is here. Excuse me. Here, probably. Oh, uh, no, it's under Steam. Uh, one sec. Steam. And then I think it's under Steam Apps. Common has been co-op for me and then we're gonna go to uh, this is your executable and then you want to go to SVIN co-op here and what you're looking for is server dot cfg server dot config right here so for me it's gonna be or for you it's gonna be your program directory steam Steam apps, common, SBIN, 7 co op, and then again, 7 co op. Open server.config file. And then what you'll want to do is add this line of code or configuration SV underscore cheats1. What this will do is allow anyone to join that joins your server to run cheats. The cheats are needed so you can respawn yourself or revive yourself after you die. You can put SV cheats 2, but if you put SV cheats 2, only admins will be able to run that. And then you can go to admins.txt, the same program directory. And then what you'll do there is you'll add a line with the name of the person. But I'm not going to go over that. Um, you just need to follow this here. Anyways, so once you have SV underscore cheats one typed in, you want to make sure to save it first. Okay, you don't have to restart the game. Go back to your game. You start a new game. Select the map. SB campaign portal. Go to game. Everything you can change you want here. Make sure uh, you select the right options that fit you best. Um, I usually put this to realistic. And then make sure your max players, if you only have two people here, you want to put your max players to two. If you have three or more, you don't need to change that. For some reason, cheats will not work if you have this set to th uh, three or above and you only have two players. So if you, ha if you only play with a buddy, have this set to two. And then start. Okay. So once you're in the game. Okay. Uh, let's say if you die. You'll be spectating. You'll want to press the. Um, tilde key I think is what it's called. That opens up your console. And then from here. You want to type in. Revive. Me. Right. And just to show you from here, we're on step three. Type revive me in console to respawn. So when you're done, you'll type revive me, press enter, and then you'll get revived. But as you can see on the screen, that quickly came and gone. It's not applicable because you're already alive. So once you respawn, you'll probably want to teleport, teleport to your buddy. So the next step is to put teleport. 
And then you should be able to teleport. I haven't tested that out yet. But the most important thing is to respawn. And that way you guys can meet up and play again. Alright, take it easy. Have a good one.